What is up you guys? It's your girl Nicole Faye and welcome back to another Juicy Fat video. As you guys can see by the title, we are talking about how to look put together, okay? In this video, we're gonna discuss the fundamental basic steps on how to look put together no matter what your bank account looks like, okay? You can literally shop at Walmart, for Christ's sakes, okay? And you can still look put together with these facts and steps, all right? I'm also gonna be discussing some things that I see that people wear that I just be like, mm. That's that's not how you look put together, okay? And if you are sensitive, before we even get into this video, Lord, <clears throat> if you are sensitive, log off. Click off this video right now, okay? Because this video is about realness, okay? I'm gonna be very real and blunt with you guys. You know your business sister would never lie to you. So if you're sensitive and you cannot take criticism, just go ahead and swipe. Wait, you can't swipe, this is YouTube, not TikTok. Go ahead and log off the video and go watch somebody else who's gonna lie to you. All right, and send you off and have you out there in the wilderness looking like a, a hot mess, all right? I'm gonna get you together. And if you wanna look put together, watch this video. Let's get started. Okay, so the first step into looking put together is looking comfortable. And I do not hear enough people talk about this, okay? Ma'am, we can all see you at the restaurant under the table unbuckling your jeans after you just ate because they're too tight, okay? We, we can see it. We can also see how tight that skirt is too, but how your thighs are rubbing together, all right? All right, all right. One thing I like to do if I know I'm gonna wear jeans that night is I like to do something called the sit down test where I basically go around my house and sit in different areas of my house to see how my jeans or whatever I'm wearing is gonna feel around my stomach and my waist, okay? Because I cannot stand when something is too tight, okay? And then I also have to think about bloatation. You don't think about that until you go to the restaurant and f***ing eat and now you're, you got the napkin over your f***ing stomach because your, your, your pants are unbuckled, okay? We all know how that feels, okay? Bloatation is normal. But if you do suffer from bloatation, you should be taking your digestive enzymes, vitamins. I've been taking those every morning. They really do work, okay? Try them out. But yes, you have to think about bloatation, okay? It is not fair to do all that work by getting cute, getting your hair done, getting your makeup done. You got your jewelry going. You're looking good. You're smelling good. And then you're uncomfortable because something is too tight, okay? No. The quickest way of looking put together is looking like you can breathe, okay? Let me say that again. The closest way to look put together is looking like you can breathe because everyone can tell. I can easily tell at a restaurant when I'm out when a girl is can't fucking walk in her heels and when her skirt is too tight, okay? You just out here just showing all your goodies because everything is tight, okay? Look comfortable, okay? When you look good, you want to feel good. And it doesn't even matter if it's just jeans. It could be shoes, your shirt, your bra, your hair. Look, we don't wanna be out here looking like that, okay? So yes, make sure whatever you wear that you are comfortable in. I don't care how cute it is. If it's too tight or you're uncomfortable in it, don't wear it because you're gonna embarrass yourself, okay? All right. The second tip on how to look put together really quick is wearing seamless underwear. Look. The spring and summer is approaching and I am so sick of seeing you guys panty lines in your skirts, leggings, and pants. <laughs> okay? Get it together, okay? Don't be offended by what I just said, okay? But it's not cute to me. I'm so sorry. When I have on a tight dress, like a tight summer dress, or I have on a tight dress or a tight skirt or some leggings, I cannot stand when my underwear is showing, okay? Get some seamless underwear. I mean, literally Walmart has seamless underwear for like $7. It is so easy to find and so easy to get, and it just makes your outfit just look so cohesive and just look put together. Like I said, you do all that work. You got your hair done, your makeup done, you're smelling good, and you're looking cute, and then you walk outside and everybody can see what kind of underwear you got on. They can see you either got on granny panties or a thong, okay? You might as well just lift up your fucking skirt and just show everybody, all right? Start investing in seamless underwear, okay? It's going to look so cohesive and make your outfit look so seamless and together. You know what I'm saying? I love wearing seamless underwear. Like, all my underwear are seamless. I only have on granny panties when it's that time of the month, okay? When it's that time of the month, I understand that you don't feel like putting on fucking seamless underwear because you don't give a fuck about nobody, even yourself, okay? I get it, all right? But I do not want to see the color of your underwear through your black leggings, and I also don't want to see the imprint of it. Okay, get it together, okay? You want to look put together? That is a number one rule. Wear seamless underwear, period. The third tip I have for how to look put together quickly is knowing what colors look good on your skin tone, okay? I feel like I always get the most compliments when I wear like an orange or yellow shade. I absolutely love those compliments when people come up to me and say, oh my gosh, girl, you look good. That is your color. That color is so good on you. You are glowing, okay? And if somebody has ever said that to you, that means you look put together instantly, okay? And I want you to wear that color in everything, okay? That color is your whole new aesthetic, okay? Your, that color is your whole new personality. I want you to wear that color in every nail color, every jean color, every shoe color. F***ing dye your hair that color, okay? 
especially if you don't know what your color is. Like, pay attention to somebody saying that color looks good on you, okay? Because that is the quickest way to look put together. Also, if you don't know your color too, I've been seeing people talk about this on TikTok, like going to get your colors professionally done by a professional, like an analyst, where basically the person puts like different cloths of colors on your skin tone to see like what colors radiant and resonate with your skin. Now, let me tell you, that assessment is not cheap, okay? I have definitely looked into it and I had to, um, I had to put that on the back burner because, you know, I just paid my taxes and the IRS took all my money, but that's a different f***ing story. Uncle Sam, count your f***ing days. But yes, definitely uh, put that on your bucket list to get that done in the future. Like I said, especially if you don't know what your colors are or if you don't know if your colors are like right. Like you feel good in this color, but you don't know if this color is right. If you're confused about that, just pay attention to when people give you compliments, whatever color you're wearing. So like if you're out and you're wearing like a, a pretty green or a baby blue or a blue shirt, and if somebody says, girl, you look good, get that color and everything. Okay, I'm telling you that is the quickest way to look put together no matter what you have on. If you have on the color, your color, you gonna be killing it, killing it, okay? But if you do know your color and you wanna be the flyest bitch in the room, get that color in everything, okay? A matching sets is another really quick and easy way to look put together. So not only do you have on a really cute matching set, but it's your color. Thank me later, okay? Thank your big sis later, okay? Because you are going to be fire. All right, so the fourth tip is gonna sound weird because you are probably so used to people saying less jewelry is better, but I actually think more jewelry is better, okay? If you wanna quickly elevate an outfit and look put together, look up, make a boring outfit look put together, jewelry it up, okay? Now, I'm not saying go in the fucking store and buy you a fucking bust down fucking chain, no! I'm not saying that, okay? Please take that shit off, all right? But put you some like two or three necklaces on, gold, silver, whatever color looks good on you. Um, Put you some rings and some bracelets on. Now I'm not saying have bracelets going all the way down here and you like double, ch no. Okay, no, okay? I love a good stack, but make sure it looks good. It's not like coming off, anyway. Yeah, I think more jewelry is better. Like I said, I've always heard less jewelry is better, but I just feel like more jewelry is a little bit more trendy now. You can easily elevate a boring looking outfit if you jewelry it up, all right? Put you some good hoops or earrings on with your necklaces, your bracelets, your rings, like, that's an easy way to make a boring outfit look like something, okay? You could take an outfit you got from literally the dollar store, put some jewelry on with it, bam be the cutest bitch in the room, period. Another tip I have on how to look put together quickly is probably a tip that's gonna piss you off, but I, I mean well, okay? Wear the right bra with your shirts, okay? You should not have on a beater tank top or a tank top and I can see your bra straps. Ma'am, no. No, I don't wanna see your bra straps. I don't wanna see your bra at all, okay? The key to looking put together is doing it so effortlessly, okay? That's the key. How are you gonna effortlessly look put together? And I can see your bra. I can see the tool that is supporting your boobs. You're showing it all to the world, okay? I shouldn't be able to see that, okay? Your boobs just look good in general and I should be like, wow, does she even have on a bra or does her just sit like that? I don't wanna see your bra, okay? If you have on a tank top, start investing in those bras that have the crisscross at the back so you can hide your bra, so you can look put together, okay? Look, I know I'm gonna rather some feathers, but that's just my opinion and my pet peeve. Get it together, okay? Like I said in the intro, if you don't like what I'm saying, and that is pretty much a wrap of today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed all of my basic steps on how to look put together really quickly. Um, yeah, I would never send you off, so please listen to my advice and don't shoot the messenger, okay? I'm just here to spread the word, okay, on how to look put together the right way, all right? You know I love you and I will never send you off and I want you to go out there and soar. So listen to my advice and take it seriously, girl, so you could be the flyest in the room, okay? Let me know in the comments, you guys, if you guys agree with any of my advice or just some tips that you have on how you look put together quickly as well. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.